YouTube, what's going on? As you guys know, I am True Triz. Today, I got an awesome video for you guys regarding a force field in Minecraft Xbox and Minecraft PlayStation. Cow, can you get out of my way? You're, you're blocking the shot here. Uh, well, if you guys can tell, I actually kind of made this little lighting thing. So when I actually turn off the lights and go into nighttime, you guys can actually see what I'm actually talking about. But anyways, today I'm going to be teaching you guys an awesome, awesome trick um, that... I think a couple of you guys know, but the reason why I'm making this is because not all you guys know, and I think it's be, I don't know, it'd benefit everyone in a way. Um, so anyways, what is this trick am I about to show you guys? It's actually involving, um, it's kind of like a force fieldish type of feeling, but it's actually kind of like a, a carpet slash cliff glitch in a way, where you can't uh, have mobs go over cliffs. So, what am I talking about? When you actually spawn a, a mob or like a zombie or something like that, and actually throw it back into whoops, my fault, uh, my fault, zombie. I'll throw it back in in uh, survival here. So, I'll go in survival mode and actually spawn a zombie. He's gonna come after me, but he can't go over. He has to go around um, the cliff just like that. So, um, hold on, quick, switch it back before I die. And quick, 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 create a mode. There we go. All right, cool. Now I won't die. Um, well, you guys kind of get the gist of it, where you, you can't really zombies can't jump over this cliff right here granted there's like a little pop up here so they're able to go under there so i'm going to delete that um but overall that's like the whole thing where zombies cannot go over cliffs just like that so you can actually implement implement that sorry excuse me um into like a force fieldish thing around your house um so what am i talking about well normally when you guys walk on carpet or whenever zombies or whatever walk on carpet nothing really happens to them it's just just normal they just walk right over it however if you guys do a little trick then it's actually really really awesome and you can actually implement that cliff thing into this little carpet glitch so what i actually do is um you can dig three deep um but i mean of course you can dig even more if you really want to or less if you really want to too because you can kind of just build it up if you insist but pretty much what you do is once you have three deep um you can actually do like two deep if you really want to you don't have to do three put a um block a, like dirt block so you can actually plant flowers granted we're gonna have another title update so we'll probably have some more flowers um once tu31 comes out if it hasn't come out by the time you guys are watching this video then uh you can actually put in flowers down here and once you have the flowers on top grab the carpet and then throw the carpet on top of the flower so once you have this zombies can still walk over it it's still not a live force field but what you're gonna have to do is go on the side of it and then come down and then delete the blocks under here and make sure then that you are three blocks deep just like that so the zombies will not come down uh, so once you have that whoops you can see i deleted the the, the carpet that was kind of jumping there um i can quick redo it if you guys insist i'll quick do that just to show you guys uh, what I'm talking about is so I can demo it to the zombies and so throw, throw the flowers down just like so and then get the carpet and throw it on top just like that and then dig three deep and once you have the three deep I can spawn some zombies in for us see the last time I kind of jumped on top of the carpet don't jump underneath it to so pop up that's really really important just don't don't do that so now let's quick go throw down some more zombies whoops hang on sorry Sorry zombies, see how they, how they kind of move around? They have to move around the, the whole entire cliff, they can't go under the right through it. So that's kind of like the force field um, type of aspect of it. And you can still walk on top of the carpet, which is really sweet. So anyways, what you want to do then, you want to go to your house. There you guys have it. I mean, I'm going to quick dig this thing up so it looks kind of natural. There we go. And uh, then what you can do is, depending on how far out you want the force field, you can just dig three deep around your house. Just like so, and that's exactly what I'm gonna be doing. And I'll okay, pop up just to make sure I'm in the still. I'm still going in the right direction here. So we got a little bit more. I could actually all end it right here, and then you can dig some more down here. And once we have the one side complete, then we can go on this one side. And I might cut it short. I'll cut it here. I'll cut my force field out over this way. Dig three deep. There we go. And then we'll dig three deep this way too. And then I can oh, kind of be a little creative and then went in away and move it around the door. And then now, there we go, we're all connecting now. So now I'm going to use the dirt block and put it too deep around the whole entire area that I want for my force field. And once we have that, I'm going to throw my flowers on top of here. And we 
we are almost done then. What I like about this glitch too is super, super easy to do in survival mode. It's not like those other like glitches where you need to like sticky pistons or anything like that. You can obviously do this thing right off the bat, which is really, really nice. So now we have that, get the carpet and throw the carpet on top. I mean, the, the only like major thing you have to really get and collect is carpet, which is not hard at all. I mean, you can just get, you don't have to worry about dying it either. I'm just using blue carpet just for the video. But uh, you can use like white carpet, obviously, you don't have to worry about the, getting it dyed. Um, so now, once we actually have this done, then I'm gonna quick go, I'm gonna dig down deep again, and I'm gonna leave everything surrounding the flowers. And make sure you don't pop your head up because you're gonna hit the carpet and then the carpet will fade away. So I'm just gonna go around in the same exact way, and then we should be able to get it. We're almost done here. Oops, quick fill this block up. And there we have it. We are good. I'm gonna delete this and then it'll fly up this way. And then we'll quick fill this thing up. There we go. So now we have a force field around our around our nice humble adobe. So I'm gonna quick go in here. I'm actually going to set it to nighttime. And then we'll put it to survival. And then we will also spawn a zombie here. You can see he won't be able to get into our house. There's like this little force field that'll stop him, which is really, really sweet, and I like that a lot. And then you get you can get some more than two and spawn them out here. And then they come through. If you guys have like a big pack of mobs, sometimes they'll push each other through, and then um, it won't work as well. Uh, so make sure if you guys do this, just be cautious. See how this guy got through? That's because there's his other buddy pushed him through there. So I'm a quick. Uh, now he's getting back in the forest. So you guys see that? Hope you guys can see how he's kind of like stuck there. I can push him back out. There we go. So now he's back in the forest field, and he won't be able to get back in until someone else like pushes him through. So. Anyways, like I mentioned before, it only works with like maybe like one or two mobs, and once they push each other through the force field, then they are in fact still a threat. But the, look at how these guys try to trying to walk all the way around my house, so they can't because there's like a there's a force field around it. But anyways, hope you guys have found this video to be useful. Um, if you guys did, make sure you guys smack the like button. Um, it'd be much appreciated. And um, we'll catch you guys in my next video. Until next time, have a great day. Stay true. Peace. Bring it back. You're watching Drew, Tris, 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 Drew,